carbon carbon bond distance this is today's lesson in this lesson we are going to learn comparison of bond distance of carbon carbon single bond carbon carbon double bond and carbon carbon triple bond so let's begin carbon carbon bond distance let us see what is the bond distance of carbon carbon single bond then carbon carbon double bond and then carbon carbon triple bond here bond distance is 147 picometer or 0.147 nanometer we know 1 nanometer is equal to 10 to the power minus 7 centimeter again 1000 picometer is equal to 1 nanometer however carbon carbon single bond distance is 147 picometer or 0 0.147 nanometer in case of carbon carbon double bond the bond distance is 134 picometer or 0 0.134 nanometer in case of carbon carbon triple bond bond distance is 120 picometer or 0 0.120 nanometer why difference in carbon carbon bonds this is today's lesson let's see the matter in detail here in case of carbon carbon single bond carbon atoms are sp3 hybridized because here no carbon carbon pi bonds that is why in this case carbon atoms are sp3 hybridized let us see orbital structure of carbon carbon single bond here sp3 hybrid orbital here sp3 hybrid orbital of this carbon in case of sp3 hybrid orbital the orbital becomes bigger in size sp3 hybrid orbitals are bigger in size in case of carbon carbon double bond as there is one pi bond here so in this case carbon atoms are sp2 hybridized one unhybridized p orbital is used to form pi bond so here hybridization is sp2 in case of sp2 hybridization the orbital is a bit smaller than sp3 hybrid orbital so here these are the sp2 hybrid orbitals the orbitals are a bit smaller than sp3 hybrid orbitals in case of carbon carbon triple bond here there are two pi bonds and one sigma bond for two pi bonds two unhybridized orbitals are required so here what is the hybridization hybridization is sp so in case of carbon carbon triple bond carbon atoms are sp hybridized let us see orbital structure of sp hybridization in this case orbitals are more is smaller sp hybrid orbital this is sp hybrid orbital sp hybrid orbitals are 
smallest and sp3 hybrid orbitals are biggest why in case of sp3 hybrid orbitals here s character is 25% and p character is 75% because here one s orbital and three p orbitals participate in hybridization total four orbitals in which s character 25% p character 75% that is why these orbitals sp3 orbitals are bigger in size but in case of sp2 hybrid orbitals in this case s character is 33.3% p character is 66.7% that is here bigger orbital p character decreases from this orbital and smaller orbital s character increases that is why ultimately sp2 orbitals are a bit smaller in size than sp3 orbitals so this is moderate in size sp2 hybrid orbitals but if we see sp hybrid orbitals then here s character 50% p character 50% half and half here in sp orbitals smaller orbital s character increases and bigger orbital p character decreases from 75% then 66.7% and here 50% so p character decreases that is why ultimately size of sp orbital is smaller in size so we can say that sp3 orbitals are bigger in size sp2 orbitals are moderate in size and sp orbitals are smaller in size as a result as these orbitals are bigger in size two atoms remain far from each other so here distance is higher but in this case orbitals are moderate in size two atoms two nuclei come closer than this case that is why here bond distance decreases but in this case as orbitals are smallest in size nuclei of two atoms remain more closer that is why in case of carbon carbon triple bond in case of sp hybrid orbitals the bond distance is smaller that is only 120 picometer here but in this case it is 134 picometer in this case 147 picometer that is bond distance decreases this is bond distance so if it is carbon carbon single bond then bond distance is higher if it is carbon carbon triple bond then bond distance is lower because of the size of hybrid orbitals again let us consider bond energy of carbon carbon single bond carbon carbon double bond and carbon carbon triple bond here bond energy is 314 kilojoule per mole but in this case bond energy is a bit higher that is 614 kilojoule per mole and in case of carbon carbon triple bond bond energy is 800 
39 kilojoule per mole. Why? In case of triple bond, bond energy is higher and in case of single bond, bond energy is lower because here two carbon atoms are connected with triple bonds, three bonds. That is why to break this bond, higher energy is required. But in case of carbon carbon single bond, only one bond is present between two carbon atoms. That is why in this case, bond energy is lower. That is only 314 kilojoule per mole. But in case of carbon carbon double bond, two atoms are connected with two bonds. That is why here moderate energy is required. That is greater than carbon carbon single bond and lower than carbon carbon triple bond. This is about bond energy of carbon carbon single bond, carbon carbon double bond and carbon carbon triple bond. This is all about carbon carbon bond distance and carbon carbon bond energy. Now today, thank you very much.